Rooster Teeth News is brought to you today by Hulu Plus. Hulu Plus lets you watch thousands of hit shows anytime, anywhere. Get an extended free trial when you visit HuluPlus.com slash Rooster Teeth. Hey guys, I'm Ashley Jenkins, and I hope you're ready for good news to send you into the weekend, because Valve has released a demo of their prototype Steam Controller in action on several PC games not previously designed for controller-style input. They showed off Portal 2, Civilization 5, Counter-Strike Go, and Papers, Please, to illustrate how the controller's bindings can work with different types of PC games. This demonstration goes some way to mollifying the concerns of those who believe that some genres of games simply can't function with controller input. Strategy games like Civ 5 are notoriously allergic to controller setups, and PC gamers have long held controllers in contempt for FPS play, not to mention the skepticism around mouse-centric games. But, of course, this is only a small sampling, and most PC gamers will prefer to decide after personal hands-on time. So if you haven't signed up for the beta, there's still time. You have until October 25th. This video is the first in a planned series, and they are taking requests for games you'd like to see played with the controller, which will be handy for those who don't end up with their own prototype controller to experiment with. Check the description below for a link to the full demo. Moving to GTA, since they always seem to be releasing some kind of update these days, Rockstar is issuing a $500,000 apology to GTA Online players for the bug-infested launch. Want to make sure you're one of them? There are only two conditions. One, you have to play GTA Online sometime during the month of October. Pretty easy. And two, you have to install the next title update they're pushing out to fix issues with vehicles lost after purchase. That update is expected sometime next week and will also include the functionality they'll be using to distribute what they're calling the GTA Online Stimulus Package. The stimulus will come in two separate deposits of $250,000 and they'll be deposited directly by Rockstar into your bank so you don't have to do anything. They're hoping to make the first deposit as early as the end of next week, but that will depend on the title update's release, and the second deposit by the end of the month. And it looks like we're not the only ones getting in on the stimulus action. Rapper Daz Dillinger claims the Rockstar is using two of his tracks in GTA V without his permission, after he declined their licensing offer for being, in his terms, offensively low. He's issued a cease and desist that demands they either make him a better offer or recall and destroy all unsold copies of the game and they have 14 days to respond. Finally, Doctor Who won't be returning to TV until later next month, but you can still get your hands on 11 new episodes. Okay, nearly new. The BBC has uncovered no less than 11 episodes of Doctor Who thought lost forever. The episodes starring the late Patrick Troughton as the second Doctor comprise two stories. In one, the Doctor does battle with an evil doppelganger. In the second, an abominable snowman causes trouble for the London Underground. The episodes from the late 60s were found in the storeroom of a Nigerian TV station in a box of tapes. The episodes were lost after the BBC junked a bunch of their early Doctor Who episodes, believing they no longer had commercial value. 97 episodes are still missing. The episodes are now available on iTunes, so hopefully they'll stick around a little bit longer this time. And that's the news for today. It's time for the weekend. Will you be getting in on that GTA Online money bonanza? What games would you like to see demoed on Valve's new controller? And do these rediscovered Doctor Who episodes get you jazzed for the show's return? Shout out in the comments below. Then check out roosterteeth.com where we'll be putting up plenty of new videos over the weekend to save you from boredom. We're kind of like heroes.